you got to pick that. You know, it's a fork in the road. You got to get that job, that nine to five, or you got to jump off that porch. You feel me? Uh, what was your choice? Jump off that porch. Ah, jump out that was, porch. Yeah, How early was it? I caught my first charge of delivery of cocaine at 13. Mm. You feel me? 12 or 13. 12 or 13. That's a young age, my G. Yeah. Yeah. So what was the situation when you caught that charge? I mean, like, um, you know, you caught a dope charge. So what they did, juvenile shit or what? Yeah, it was juvenile because, like, when I when I caught the charge, I was literally, I was playing football. That's not playing for Danny the um, Bulldog. Uh -huh. I was walking to practice, and that's when the Raiders jumped out and grabbed me. All right, so let's talk about your name though, Psycho Bob. How how you come up with that name? Uh, you feel me? First, I came up with a name from seeing Psycho Bob. You feel me? How he had his hair, everything, and then I fit the name though. I turned it to Psycho Bob, then I fit the name from how I was living. You mm. feel me? Tell me something. When motherfucker asks you your name, what you tell them? Psycho Bob? Yeah. What they be reaction be? They just go to laughing. <laughs> the female, they 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 go to laughing like what you. They say, oh, I hope you ain't gonna be psycho psycho to me. <laughs> you feel me? So like, nah, I'd be psycho to you in a different way, but not the, like the, you feel me, discreet way. You feel me? That's what's up. That's what's up, my nigga. Where you from? Dania. Dania. Yeah. I mean, for the people who don't know, because you know, when people think of Florida, South Florida, they think Fort Lauderdale, um, you know, Pompano, yeah. Miami. So Dania, where is that exactly? By Hollywood. Hollywood. Uh, yeah, Liberia, Dania. That's what's up. Same That's what's up. So what can you tell me different from Dania than any other part of uh, South Florida? We get funky down there. You know? yeah. yeah, man. Everything. You feel me? Everything. Everything. Now, it's like the same, but you no know, the real people here, but, oh, but shit. That's what's up. That's what's up. All right, so your ethnicity. I mean, what you, American, Haitian, Jamaican? What's your ethnicity? American. Full American. Bloody ain't. Yeah, yeah, so that's that's crazy because most people be like, oh, Kodak only fuck with Haitians and shit like that. You feel nah, me? Nah, that ain't true. He fuck with whoever real. You feel me? Whoever he feel real, he gonna fuck with. That's real. You feel me? That's real. That's real. All right, so um, growing up in Dania, how would you say that influenced your sound, your music and shit like that? Like, I grew up listening to Beach Cat. You feel me? And he got me into the music shit like. Like, I just seen how he was rocking the mic, so I said, shit, let me try it. You feel me? I done lived a lifestyle. I can talk about it. You feel me? I ain't going to just talk about some shit I ain't do. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. So, everything. That's what's up. All right, so growing up, like, as far as school and shit like that, um, like, you in school, how how was that interaction? Did you fuck with school or not? What was the situation? I ain't fuck with school like that, though. I was skipping in the hallways, skipping in the, you feel me, jumping school gates. I've been in a turning school down there. You feel me? Elementary, middle school, high school. I've been in tournament schools, you feel mm -hmm. me? And other than that, went to programs, juvenile programs in my middle school year. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so um, let's talk about money. I mean, com coming up, you know, it's a point in time where you, you got to pick that, you know, it's a fork in the road. You got to get that job, that nine to five, or you got to jump off that porch. You feel me? Yeah. Uh, what was your choice? Jump off that porch. Ah. Jump out that was, porch. Yeah, How early was it? I caught my first charge of delivery of cocaine at 13. Mm. You feel me? 12 or 13. 12 or 13. That's a young age, my G. Yeah. Yeah. So what was the situation when you caught that charge? I mean, like, um, you know, you caught a dope charge. So what they did, juvenile shit or what? Yeah, it was juvenile. Cause like, when I when I caught the charge, I was literally, I was playing football. That's not playing for Danny the um, Bulldog. Uh -huh. I was walking to practice. And that's when the Raiders jumped out and grabbed me. You feel me? I'm like, what they grabbing me for? I got football <laughs> clothes on. You feel me? I'm a jet. So yeah. I'm like, what they grabbing me for? Whole time they got pictures of me serving. You feel me? God I'm damn. Another cause. Yeah. yeah. And at that time, was that you? Was that you doing your own thing, or was it like you know your introduction to the game? Normally, it's like an OG. You know yeah. what I mean? Type yeah, like, situation. My uncle, though, my dad, brother, he he gave me some shit. You feel me? Jitter boy. He you feel me? He influenced me to you feel me grind, get, do my little hustling and all this stuff. And first boom, you feel me? I don't fuck around and call it the lil. So I start saying, "God damn!" <laughs> I got, yeah, you feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's yeah. real out there. Yeah, it's real. So that's real. I mean, a lot of niggas just rapping and shit. You feel me? Yeah. Talking about thirteen, your first charge. So that's that's, that's some real shit. You living the shit. Charge, yeah, yeah. We about twenty deep on the block. Everybody running out the car, rushing to the car, bossing each other out the corner night. Yeah, yeah. 
Run for the, you feel me? Running up to that for that money, you feel me? Getting them sales. Getting them sales. That's what's up. That's what's yeah. up. So I mean, like that situation though. What was your like? What was your your whole mindset when you was running up to these cars at thirteen years old? What was you thinking? What was in your mind? I gotta get this money. Uh-huh. You feel me? Like gotta beat the next person to it. Yeah. Gotta beat the next person to it. Let's talk about your time in jail though. Your experience in jail because you've been through that. You know yeah. what I mean? From a young nigga to uh, most recently. So, um, I mean, let's talk about that experience. Jail, your first time. What was you going? What you thinking about? Like, you know what I mean? Go into detail. First time, like, what, juvenile or adults? Adults. Let's talk about adults. Adults. First time, I bought that. I had, there was um, a warrant for um, missing court, though. I bought that. But, like, the one time, like, my first time, like, sitting in there and shit was like for, um, what it was, aggravated um, assault with a firearm. And I sat there. I just, I've been doing time since I was a jit, so like I was going to program shit, so it like it wasn't nothing. You feel mm-hmm. me? So, and then like my whole hood and niggas from who know me from the streets, they already like every unit I go in, my name ringing up, so they gonna treat you. You feel me? As long as you don't, yeah, your name ring, you ain't snitching on the nigga, you ain't doing no no wrong. So yeah. whatever you landing in the unit, they gonna fuck with you. They gonna respect you. Yeah. You feel yeah. me? So yeah, that's it. What's up? Alright, so I mean, what you do to pass time while you in there? So, pick up an urban book. Read some urban books. Uh, you feel me? I just be on the phone and read urban books. Yeah. You feel yeah. me? Take up. You feel me? Get on the phone. Be on the world. Be, yeah, be my own little brother. I don't really be all that. I don't play cards and all that shit. Though. Yeah, yeah. Um, What was the most serious like situation you would say you got into out here in these streets? Uh, Robbery, kidnapping, robbery, firearm, kidnapping, attempted murder. You feel me? That's the worst charge I got. God damn. So what you, I mean, that's what, life? You facing life or some shit like yeah, that? Yeah, the, the bottom of my guideline is life. You feel me? So, and then when I go to court, I'm one of the young, youngest nigga in rock court. You feel me? me how, court, how old? Me. How old were you? Uh, that's recently. Mm. That's not right. Recently, right now. 24. Okay. So what you out on bond or what? I'm out on probation. Okay. Okay. So we, we ain't gonna do the Vlad TV shit, yeah. you know what I mean? So we ain't gonna get into details about that, yeah. you know what I mean? But um, I mean, shit, that's some real shit to talk about, you know what I mean? Yeah. 